Martin, we're joined with Sam Sharman. We're just on our way down to the Centurion Club. And, uh, you know, we've got about an hour and a half left. I've got a question for Sam. I've got a deep question. It's a question I want you to all think about as well. Is how much would it cost you to never touch a golf club again? So that means you literally, Sam, not just you can't play golf again. You can't sell and you can't touch one, can't look at one. Yeah, you can't touch a golf club again. And do you know where these questions come from? Do you remember the player that once got injured and took an insurance, it, it got paid out, and part of the p payout, he was, he were, were he Chinese? I don't know. That's Anthony sorry. Kim. We can, All right, yeah, on, yeah, yeah, on uh, PJ Tour, yeah. Yeah, um, you might remember this guy, so he got injured, he took a payout, but part of that where he could never play golf again, and not even casual golf, he couldn't play he couldn't golf play again, golf. otherwise, Obviously, I don't know, would he get arrested or he'd have to, pay, he'd have to get money back? Probably have to get money back, yeah. So, it were a question that we were, was, we were having a conversation at work with Boss Alex, um, and it got quite deep. And I thought, oh, you know what, this is a really good question. Have you had a think about it? Uh, do you know what, I'm trying to process. I think playing golf, honestly, Yeah. if you turn around to me tomorrow and gave me a decent sum of money, if you turn around with Oh, no. 250 grand. Do you know what? That was to, my first answer. To never play golf right. again, I'd that, be like... That was my first answer, but then I thought about it a bit more. Uh, you see, I don't love, I don't love golf that much anymore. No, but you've got to think our careers around golf. So, right, you take the I mean, just with grand. playing, just with playing. Like, purely just playing. What, so you just don't think you can do your job without touching a golf? No, 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 no. I'm just saying, if it was just playing, 250 grand, I'd give you my golf clubs and never play golf again. Like, I'm, th I'm thinking right. situation. Yeah, but then what are you going to do I'd turn around, 250 job? grand, and sell miles, miles. <laughs> <laughs> no. But I, I, but I mean, yeah, 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 I know what you're saying. But to never touch a golf club again permanently, so not yeah. be able to work in golf, uh, you've got to have enough money to be comfortable for something that's going to pay a wage. So, if you're looking at a good golfer's wage, you're going to need to be pulling in. Uh, I don't know. Four million? Four million? Yeah. Well, that is a bit steep. So, Matt, Matt, to cover you for the rest of your life, if you're going into buying properties or something yeah, like that. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. If, if someone had to pay me, I'd be four million quid. Not moving. Well, I was thinking buying a house, you know, well, when I start to think about it, yeah, so I buy a house, 150 grand, I live in Barnsley, guys. Uh, 150 grand, pay that off. 100 grand, I could get, you know, a couple of buy to lets. Yeah. And, Live off them, um, but then I was thinking, like, where, are you gonna do? where does that leave me with yeah. my life? You know what am I going to do? I, I play golf for fun. I work with big golf. It's a lot bigger sum than you think. Yeah. I mean, I need. I, I, and Alex said, like, she uh, she said, what 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 would you do? What would you, what sport would you do? Because you're not going to be able to not play sport, are you? If you were to finish in golf, what would you do? I want to see in comments, guys. I want to see your answers to this. How much would it cost you to never pick a golf club up again? Do you know what? I'd like what to have a go. What would you do with your spare time? I'd like to have a go at like a football agent or something like that. Would you? Yeah. Well, it, it, we're, we're very similar, right? Yeah. I said I'd want to pay me house off. I'd want a few rental properties to pull in some sort yeah, of cash flow. Cool. And I'd get a season ticket. I'm a Man U fan. I'd get a season ticket. And... Uh, you know, watch football at weekend. Yeah, it doesn't sound that good an idea a minute, does it? I mean, uh, do you want me to get your job in Amazon depot or something and we'll put you out of your misery? <laughs> what would you do? Would you, would you play a sport or would you just get a football season ticket? I mean, the stuff that you'd have to do. To be fair, I enjoy my pool. Yeah. So, I'm terrible at snooker. I'm good at yeah. pool, I'm terrible at snooker. I try not to go, you know, play snooker. Why not? What, snooker? Yeah. Ah. Yeah, do you know what? I, I do enjoy a game of snooker, but it's inside. It's like you're always yeah, inside, it's smoky, but dark. Sounding, without sounding patronised, mate, guys. We're getting any younger. So you're not going to be concerning pro with your football. Yeah. Right? <laughs> it's my birthday today. I'm your cricket game's football. not getting. 34, is that you it? Know it I did actually. I did <laughs> on Facebook earlier. That's why I bought you a uh, Pepsi Max and a bag of. <laughs> Monster Munch or whatever they were. Well, I couldn't take up green. Uh, do you know what? It's same birthdays. I bet it's 
nearly 10, 12 years now since you started teaching me golf. Yeah, I, I, <laughs> it, it is. I, Sam, you were in my first ever golf academy, weren't you? First ever golf first, academy. First, first ever it. golf academy. And I'd have been, I don't know. 10, 11? Yeah. I bet, I bet it's 10, oh, 11 years. Oh, I mean, years. I can put some pictures in this vlog if yeah. you want. Yeah, take a picture of <laughs> <laughs> I've got some beauties of it when he first started. Yeah, get those in. I'll get a couple yeah, of pictures of Sam Nah in vlog when you're a young whippersnapper. And you know what? I think you were wearing purple as well. I think I did. I had a, uh, a purple... Pink. Nah, no, it was pink. Nah, pink I don't remember what it was. Yeah. And in fact, Robbo was on some of that pictures. Yeah, we've got James Robinson yeah, James on some as some well, yeah, because he was just doing his PG. I think I were a couple of years in and James started and he had to come and do some junior coaching, didn't he? Yeah. So he come up to our place to help out with juniors. So I've got a couple of pictures of Robbo as well. We'll get them in. But uh, scattering conversation here a little bit. It's 11th of June. Who else's birthday is at 11th of June? So I only just found out this year. Did you? It's someone else's birthday today. Oh, it's massive. Rick Shields? <laughs> <laughs> the Queen. The Queen's birthday. It's the Queen's birthday. Same Auntie day Barbara. As mine. Yeah. Auntie Barbara's birthday. Unbelievable. And I'm 34, guys, and I've only just, you know, I've only just uh, found that out this year. Absolutely, 34. And if we've got any any campaigners looking to settle down with guys, get in my inbox. We're going to try and set them up a bit. Nah, honestly, I'm enjoying <laughs> single life. Um, Robbo keeps going on it, mate. You're nearly 40 now, guys. When are you going to settle down? <laughs> we'll get him a dog first. We'll get Do him you a know dog. what? It, it, it might be on cars. Yeah? It might be, well, probably not a dog. I don't know. I do I do like going to Robbo's own. I do like dogs. He's got a couple of cock. Yeah, he has. Yeah, they're nice. Jameson will always be my favourite, though. What's the other one called? Uh, God. I'm having a mind blank now. Jameson. Um, I'm sure it's to do with alcohol. <laughs> you know what it's like. Cheers, it is. It is. Is it? Uh, what's it called? Ah, uh, is it brew? Dog? Is it brew? It's brew. called it brew. <laughs> That's his favourite ale. Like Cheers and brew. So we are flying. And we're an hour out. Yeah. Now we're out to watch. A the final day at Live Tour at Centurion, which, you know, we've already said earlier, we're going to observe. We're not probably supporting the players so much. It feels a bit weird, doesn't it, a minute? I can't, we can't comment too much until we've been. We can't comment too much, you know, but there's been so much negativity about this event, and I don't feel like, I don't feel like way excited. I'm a bit like, I'm sat on the fence here. It's hard to make a comment, isn't it? Because someone's always going to pick you up and go, no. I'm looking forward to having a walk around, <laughs> seeing a bit of golf, having a pint, hopefully, you know, seeing a few people. But I'm not like thinking, oh, right, I really want Mickelson to win this, or I really want Westwood, or I really want, you know, uh, Pollard to win. I'm kind of not fully, I'm not, I don't feel like supporting them at the minute, I'm going to be honest, Sam. You know, I don't care if any sponsors or brands you know, don't agree with that because that's how I feel and maybe that might change but I think there's a lot of people who probably feel like that minute. They just don't know what to feel. So. Well, I mean, a lot of sponsors have pulled out, haven't they? I've been reading last night about uh, the Shambo sponsors pulling out. Not that yeah. these sponsors, but multiple to millionaire, but... I think, I think we're all just a bit... Well, we're going to find out anyway, so... We'll have some content coming so, next week. On the summer, days. four million. I'd never touch golf club again. <laughs> Any, anyone wants to test it? I'll put my bank details in the description. Do you know what? I'm going to undercut you. No, actually, do I want to do that? Because it's going to ruin my life. I mean, no, I'll take it. No, actually, two no, million. I'll take, yeah. I might take two, I'll undercut you. <laughs> two million. I'm still not 100%. I'm not going to sign and seal it, but oh. I, I consider it. I never have to play golf again. What if it were two million from yeah. Saudi though? Don't answer that. Don't answer that. Dubai! <laughs> Don't answer that. We'll see you guys in a few days' time. See you soon, guys. Bye.